Oh, Apple, Apple, Apple. You know, I'm always telling people to be happy, but yesterday I was not happy. I was furious yesterday because Apple did not update Apple Music within iOS 14. Or at least that's what we thought because Apple didn't mention anything, but under the hood of iOS 14, I found 15 new features and changes inside of Apple Music. Before I actually tell you all the 15 new features and changes inside of Apple Music, I just wanted to let you guys know that I have five public Apple Music playlist. I've got Fresh Lemonade, which is the latest music and the best music. Old Lemons, which is the best oldies. Disney, 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 which is, well, Disney music. I've got Breathe, which is the most calming lemons in the entire industry, so you can study, relax, or do whatever the heck you want. And then I've got the Not In English playlist, which is music that is not in English. So all of those playlists are available. Links are in the description if you guys wanna follow me on Apple Music. And yeah. All right, so here we go. This is my iPhone SE running iOS 13 inside of Apple Music. Let's start things off. We now get a Listen Now tab inside of Apple Music, which will basically, Apple will recommend us playlists, artists, radio stations, songs. This is a pretty cool one, Stations for You, and it's gonna grab a bunch of stations just recommended on what you listen to. Inside of the new Listen Now section, as you guys can see, your replay playlists are now available. So before this was actually in beta, it's been in beta for almost a year. I'd say replay, if you guys do not know what this is, Apple Music will actually play and will actually put a playlist for you of the songs that you've actually listened to, mo to the most in 2018, 2019, 2017. And this one's actually pretty cool because this is actually the 2021. And the 2021 will actually update itself throughout the year. Also new on Apple Music is the new search. Look at this, look how cool this looks. We get a bunch of different genres. For example, let's go ahead and tap on rock. We got a bunch of suggested um, rock music, rock album, rock playlist. Also check this out, previously on search, let's go ahead and search up Rosalia for example. Check this out, as you guys can see, it says Rosalia and it says a bunch of different things, but at the bottom, it actually shows us Rosalia the artist, a song, a playlist, an album. Before, it was just all like this, which was kind of hard and not a good design at all. Right now, before actually searching, you can just go straight to the artist. This top bar when you search on Apple Music is also new. So as you guys can see, you can actually filter, for example, Rosalia. I only want playlists from Rosalia. So you can actually filter on search now on Apple Music, which is incredible. So I can see a bunch of different um, playlists that people have made on Apple Music or maybe just songs. Everything is now available, so filter on search Available on Apple Music, I am so happy right now. Also new with iOS 14 is widgets. So as you guys can see, Apple Music is actually now available as a widget. So I can simply tap my playlist right there and it will open straight from the home screen. We've seen this before on the iPad, but this is actually the first time that we've seen it on the iPhone. And this is not the only widget that you can actually install in iOS 14. If you press on the plus and you click on music, there's actually three different widgets. This is actually a huge one, um, middle one. I actually really like this small one, so we can actually grab that and just place it right here. All right, check this out. For example, let's tap on this song, which is just a single. As you guys can see, since it's just a single, there is nothing after this song. So whenever the song ends previously on Apple Music, it would just end. But we now get this small icon, which basically lets you Always, there's always gonna be music playing, and after this song plays, um, there's gonna be even more. So there's always gonna be music playing. This new feature is called autoplay, and it is incredible. And Apple actually stole this from Spotify, but I'm, I'm glad they stole it from Spotify. The design when you actually play a song has actually changed as well. As you guys can see, the artwork is green, so the background is kind of greenish. So it actually changes depending on the artwork. As you guys can see, it's totally gone black right now. Playlists, albums, and songs that have actually changed in design, and the sole purpose of this is to give more importance to the actual artwork. Before, the artwork was very small, but now it's centered, it is big, and I really, really like this change. Also, when there's information about an album, this will pop up before it just scrolled 
down, but now you actually get a pop-up and you, act, you can actually read a bunch of information about that album or about a specific artist. New on Apple Music is set list. You can actually see the set list of a concert of a specific artist. So for example, I saw that Miki is an artist that I really like here from Spain. He actually have, here, here we go. You can actually see the set list of Miki. So you can actually see the set list that he's gonna be singing in his next concert. So the artist actually put this on side of Apple Music, which is super cool. All right, so if we switch over to the iPad, we can see that the design has changed over here as well. We get this new sidebar with all of our playlists. Also, the dock is also new on the iPads. And if we actually tap, we now get a full screen design. And when the song is playing with full screen, you get full screen lyrics. So you can have a freaking karaoke if you want singing your favorite song. All right, so those are all the changes and all the new features inside of Apple Music. Let me know in the comments down below if I have missed any. And yeah, that's it. Listen to my playlist because they are freaking amazing. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace. That's life. That's life. That's what all the people say.